Introducing Brooke Adams, a well-known figure in Hollywood who has made a big impression on many. Can you think back to the first time you saw her on screen and how it stuck with you? Maybe she played a role in a story that really inspired or influenced your life. Feel free to share your favorite memories or experiences with this classic Hollywood actor in the comments below. Stay tuned for some interesting, surprising, and maybe even sad facts about her. More surprises coming your way. Born on February 8, 1949, in New York City, Brooke Adams comes from a family deeply connected to the entertainment world. Growing up surrounded by art in the city, she found her passion for acting in a household that valued the arts. Her father, Robert K. Adams, a prolific television producer, exposed her to the industry early on. This familiarity likely contributed to her comfort in front of the camera. Brooke Adams began her acting journey in the early 1970s. A significant moment was landing a role in the well-received film Days of Heaven, directed by Terrence Malick. This experience marked a turning point, propelling her into the spotlight and showcasing her acting talent. Over the years, she navigated through Hollywood, taking on various roles that highlighted her versatility. Notable projects such as Invasion of the Body Snatchers and The Dead Zone added depth to her portfolio, solidifying her presence in the industry. Her career reflects dedication and talent, with each role contributing to the rich history of her filmography. Beyond the glamour of Hollywood, her journey reveals a genuine passion for the craft rooted in her formative years. In conclusion, Brooke Adams's early life, shaped by a family ingrained in the entertainment world, laid the foundation for a successful career. Her journey, marked by pivotal moments and diverse roles, showcases a talent that resonates through Hollywood history. In the glitzy world of Hollywood, Brooke Adams reflects her family's deep ties to entertainment. Raised in this creative environment, she discovered her passion early on. Her father, Robert K. Adams, an experienced TV producer, set her on the path to acting. Starting her career in the early 1970s, Adams faced a turning point with her role in Terrence Malick's well-received film Days of Heaven. This moment thrust her into the limelight, revealing her natural talent and paving the way for a varied and long-lasting career. The silver screen became her canvas, and each role added depth to her filmography. In interviews, co-stars reminisce about working alongside Adams, highlighting her dedication and the lasting impression she made. Anecdotes from the set of Invasion of the Body Snatchers showcase her presence, contributing to the film's success. Colleagues describe her as a collaborator, bringing an interesting dynamic to every project. Adams's journey through Hollywood is more than a sequence of roles, it's a narrative filled with passion. The Dead Zone showcased her versatility, cementing her place in cinematic history. Beyond the scripts and sets, her genuine love for the craft resonates, a quality rooted in her early years surrounded by the arts. In Hollywood, where stories unfold both on and off the screen, Adams's influence is undeniable. Her journey, marked by diverse characters and collaborations, reflects a rich history that continues to captivate audiences. As we explore her filmography, the layers of her talent unfold, creating a lasting connection with those who appreciate the art of storytelling. In the expansive realm of Hollywood, Brooke Adams embarked on her journey at a young age, stepping onto the stage at six and gracing television screens at 16. Her connection to the entertainment world, nurtured by her father, Robert K. Adams, a seasoned TV producer, laid the foundation for her future in acting. Acknowledged in John Willis' Screen World Vol. 30 as one of the promising new actors of 1978, Adams quickly gained recognition. Notably, in March 2004, she faced a health challenge when her appendix was removed, revealing the hurdles that even experienced actors encounter off-screen. Her pivotal role in Terrence Malick's Days of Heaven during the early 1970s marked a turning point, thrusting her into the spotlight. The silver screen became Adams's canvas, and her filmography evolved with diverse roles in projects like Invasion of the Body Snatchers and The Dead Zone. Colleagues remember her not only for on-screen contributions, but also for dedication and collaborative spirit. On the set of Invasion of the Body Snatchers, her presence contributed to the movie's success, showcasing her as a vital collaborator. The Dead Zone further exemplified her versatility, solidifying her place in movie history. Adams's journey through Hollywood is more than a sequence of roles, it's a narrative filled with passion. Beyond scripts and sets, her genuine love for the craft resonates, a quality rooted in her early exposure to the arts. 
In a world where stories unfold both on and off the screen, her influence remains undeniable, creating a lasting connection with audiences who appreciate the art of storytelling. Her career, marked by various characters and collaborations, reveals layers of talent, leaving a lasting impact on the industry. As we explore her filmography, the richness of her contribution becomes apparent, shaping a narrative that extends beyond the screen. Brooke Adams graced the stage at the Music Box Theater in New York City alongside her husband, Tony Shalhoub, until August 2010, marking a significant moment in her career. This showcased her talent in the theater scene of a city she holds dear. In 1967, she stepped into the world of feature films with her debut role in a New York City-based musical called All the Other Outs in Free, directed by Ray Russell. Unfortunately, the film was never released, but this early experience set the stage for her future in the industry. Adding another layer to her Hollywood connections, Brooke Adams is the sister of actress Lynn Adams and the sister-in-law of Michael Shalhoub and Susan Shalhoub Larkin. These family ties intertwine with her own journey, creating a network within the industry. The collaborative nature of her work is evident not just through her marriage, but also through anecdotes from colleagues who remember her as a dedicated collaborator. The set of Invasion of the Body Snatchers stands as proof of her presence contributing to the film's success. This collaborative spirit extends beyond the screen, creating a dynamic that enriches every project she takes on. Brooke Adams's journey through Hollywood isn't just a sequence of roles, but a narrative filled with passion. Her versatility, showcased in projects like The Dead Zone, secures her place in cinematic history. Colleagues recall her not only for on-screen contributions, but for her genuine love for the craft rooted in early exposure to the arts. As we explore her filmography, the layers of her talent unfold, creating a lasting connection with audiences who appreciate the art of storytelling. The depth of her impact on the industry is apparent, shaping a narrative that extends beyond the screen. Brooke Adams's journey is a reflection of dedication, collaboration, and a genuine love for the craft qualities that echo through Hollywood history. Brooke Adams has deep ancestral roots in English and a touch of German heritage with family ties stretching back to colonial New England, specifically Massachusetts and Connecticut. Rumors suggest a connection to U.S. President John Adams, although she is not a direct descendant. In 1976, she reportedly declined an offer to join the original cast of Charlie's Angels, a decision that marked a distinctive moment in her career. During the Broadway production of The Heidi Chronicles in 1988, Adams crossed paths with her future husband, Tony Shalhoub. They married in 1992 and expanded their family through the adoption of two daughters Josie Lynn, welcomed into Adams's life before marriage, and later adopted by Shalhoub and Sophie, adopted by the couple post-wedding. Her collaborative spirit extends to both personal and professional life. On Broadway, she shared the stage with Shalhoub until August 2010, showcasing her theatrical prowess. Notably, her debut in feature films dates back to 1967 in the unreleased musical All the Other Outs in Free, setting the stage for a lasting career. Family ties remain a consistent theme in her narrative as she is the sister of actress Lynn Adams and sister-in-law to Michael Shalhoub and Susan Shalhoub Larkin. This interconnected network within Hollywood speaks to the collaborative nature that defines her journey. As we delve into her cinematic journey, her influence goes beyond roles. It's a narrative filled with dedication and passion, leaving a lasting impression on the industry. Her versatility and collaborative spirit, witnessed on and off the screen, contribute to a story that resonates with those who appreciate the art of storytelling.